welcome back to our channel. For those who haven't been here before, we are the Two Wheel Buckeyes. I'm Keith. I'm Dawn. And you're in for a real treat today. We're going to take you to get some hot dogs. Not just any hot dog, but some hillbilly good hot dogs. We're going to take you down to, for a scenic ride down to West Virginia to Hillbilly Hot Dogs. It's an establishment that's uh, been around since I believe they said 1999 and just started out as a little roadside stand selling weenies and it's turned into something very unique. It's a very scenic ride down to West Virginia so come along with us. We ask that you please hit the subscribe and like button. So get your leather, get your helmet, because safety first, and let's grip it and rip it. Well, we decided to stop here and fuel up, and it looks like there's some rain heading in the direction we're going. Uh, it's really nice behind us. So we're just going to hang out here for a few minutes and uh, let this rain pass that's ahead of us while Dawn eats her Twizzlers, which is the official snack of Two Wheel Buckeyes. <laughs> 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 And then I have my Mountain Dew, so that's my official drink. gas station because we missed the rain so we're gonna go get in line up here get some hot dogs <laughs> and then we will do a little tour of the area how about that let's see a little bit more of hillbilly hot dog up here there's a pretty good line but beautiful day like this this is what you'd expect at Hillbilly Hot Dog. So we'll go get in line and see what they got. Take a look at the menu here. 
all kinds of little gifts here as you're standing in line. I think we got one of those stickers or magnets for our refrigerator already at home for our previous visits. On the AWN. And we're going to actually eat inside just to show you, show you the buses. There's a pair of uh, autograph skivvies up there on the wall. They're not mine. We got two school buses that you can eat at. We're going to go in one right here. Duck. We'll take a little higher view here first after we've had our food. <laughs> you can see it gets a lot longer line. Yeah. Oh, that's we're cute. We're going to take a walk around and show you the whole place. Lots of bikes here today. And that's where we're at. Hillbilly Hot Dogs. <laughs> Turned out to be a really sunny day today. We got through a little bit of the rain coming down. Teeny weeny land. <laughs> Apparently some bluegrass tonight. See, it's just right along the river, called River Road. The line's gotten pretty long, and there's, those are the buses we were actually eating in. <laughs> Definitely part of the experience to eat in there, but it does get a little stuffy. Uh -huh. Yeah, not a lot of air circulation. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, that's not the only restroom here. <laughs> um, that's the food pickup if you're eating outside. What do you call a happy cowboy? What do you call a happy cowboy? A jolly rancher. <laughs> <laughs> And that's the stand-up comedian portion of our video <laughs> today. And what would a hillbilly hot dog be without the moonshine still? Let's go see what's in here.
think I used that typewriter in college when I was doing some papers. <laughs> Interesting Harley mm -hmm. paint color. Trike. And another three wheeler. And we're here at the Hillbilly Hot Dog Wedding Chapel. You bring your. And you really can get married here. Oh, really? This is a thing. It's on their website. They give you all the information. Yeah, wedding and rentals. All that Bring your significant <laughs> other and come out here and have a hot dog and get hitched. Yep. Yeah, I suppose you can just stand here if you don't fall through. <laughs> have the kissing booth right beside the wedding chapel. Well, how was your hamburger, Dawn? It was delicious. It was really good. It's huge. Mm -hmm. I had the Buckeye hot dog yeah. with chili and coleslaw. coleslaw. It's excellent. Very good burger. And I had a side of onion rings. So the food is Probably better than what you would expect. <clears throat> and when you come here, it's all about timing because we got here about 45 minutes ago, an hour ago maybe, and we didn't have too long of a line, but if you look right now, that line is way backed up. And it's, it's been about an hour, so yeah, it gets busy. It'll get really busy out here. So, plan on standing in line or get here early. to Hillbilly Hot Dogs. What'd you guys think? Leave any comments below if you've been down here before. We are now going to head back up River Road and we're actually we're going to be stopping at Baxter Harley Davidson. So you'll see a little bit of that as we head back up 35. But it's turned out to be a beautiful day so enjoy the scenery. those of you that have been down here in past years, not sure exactly when they, they did it, but I don't remember this from last year, is they've repaved a lot of this road. And uh, as you can see, the first section is kind of rough, but glad to see they've resurfaced a big section of this river road, make a little smoother ride. It turned out to be a beautiful day as we ride along the river. We're on River Road now, which I believe is like Route 7, but we'll be hopping on 35 here in just a minute.
head into Baxter's Harley Davidson. See what this is all about. We've been past here so many times on Route 35, but we've actually never stopped. Well, the first thing that hits me is how cool it is in here. It's not that hot outside, but it's about 80. Pretty good size dealership. And here's some more of the pre-owned bikes they've got on the floor. They've got pretty good, pretty good inventory of pre-owned. Well, that was our bike adventure down to West Virginia and Hillbilly Hot Dogs. I hope you enjoyed going along with us. What'd you think, Don? Thought it was great. The food was great. The ride was great. The weather cleared out just in time. We had a little bit of clouds going down, but cleared up. It's been a beautiful day. Yeah, the one thing that stood out for me is that even though Hillbilly Hot Dogs is kind of a novelty destination, the food was actually really good. Mm -hmm. I was a very, very surprised and always very surprised about how good their hot dogs are. Mm -hmm. So if you get a chance, definitely head down there. If you've been down there before, uh, drop a comment down below. Let us know what you thought and what every, to let everybody else know what you thought as well. We do ask that you please hit the like and subscribe button below so we can continue to do some bike adventures for you that uh, hopefully will help you in your next bike adventure. So until our next adventure, we'll see ya. See ya.